Hello and welcome to another straightforward tutorial. Today, I will show you the best quality export settings for your YouTube video using Filmora. Before starting, I should mention that I'm using the free version of Filmora, and sadly the free version puts a rather large watermark on the rendered video. It also attaches a small outro containing the Filmora logo. I definitely recommend buying the software, as it has very powerful and easy to understand tools, such as the ones we will use today to export our video. To render a video, Go to export and click create video. Click on export with watermark option. If you're using the free version too, it will also direct you to log into your account with Wondershare here. If you haven't created one already, you would be required to do so. As I'm already logged in, it will open the export window. On the left side of this window, you can choose different video formats. We will stick with MP4 as that is the best for YouTube. Then you have your standard settings here, such as the name, the location, the resolution, and the frame rate. One really handy feature is that Filmora also calculates the size of the final video file. To change the quality of the export, click on Settings. In the Settings window, you can choose from three predefined quality settings. These quality settings essentially changes the bit rate. The higher the bit rate, the greater the quality and the file size. Other settings include the encoder, which should be set to H.264 for best compression. The resolution and frame rate will be automatically calculated based on your video so you shouldn't change them as well. As mentioned, the bitrate controls the quality of the final video. However, changing the bitrate doesn't affect the quality as much as it affects the video size. If I set a low bitrate of 4000 kbps, you will see that the video size is now 8.6 MB. And now if I set it to moderately high, the new projected size is 31 MB. Here is the comparison of videos of both different sizes. And as you can see, there isn't much difference in quality between both of them. So any bit rate value will give you excellent results in terms of video quality, and you should choose it based on your size requirements. If you have a large storage space and fast internet connection, then definitely go with a larger bit rate. As I understand, a lot of my followers are just starting out on YouTube and they might not have many expensive resources. They would be happy to hear that even with a smaller bit rate, they can get great results without having to handle a large video file. As for the audio, I have find the default settings to work best with my headphones. Once the setting is completed, click on export. Filmora will start exporting the video. It also gives you an option to shut down the computer once the rendering is complete. It is a neat option to have for those larger video exports. I hope you like this tutorial. It was pretty straightforward because Filmora is really easy to use and understand. Please let me know in the comments if you need help with anything and if you have any suggestions for future videos. Thank you all for watching.